Welcome to Goalie's Pip Academy. Hey, bug buddies. Let's dive into the buzzin' world of bees and wasps. Now, you might be thinking, aren't they the same? Well, let me tell you, even the bug experts often mix them up. But it's all in the details, my friends. Bees make their nests from wax, while wasp nests are made from paper-like materials, such as chewed wood. See, bees have chubby bodies, legs that could double as a pancake spatula, and hair that would make any hairdresser squirm. It's like they are always ready for a big ball party. This fuzziness is handy for collecting and spreading pollen far and wide. Wasps, on the other hand, are slender and smooth with legs as puny as dental floss. Talk about embracing minimalism. Quiz time. Brainiacs, are you ready for the challenge? Wasps make their nests from wax, true or false? If you guessed false, yes, you got it. Wasps are a crafty bunch and make their nests from materials like chewed wood. Who knew wasps were such DIY fans? Next up, let's talk about their favorite meals. Bees love to feast on plant pollen and flowering plant nectar. In fact, they like nectar so much that a worker bee spends eight hours a day for a month to collect a teaspoon of this sweet elixir. Talk about dedication. Wasps, on the other hand, are like the ninjas of the insect world. They're incredible hunters, constantly on the lookout for insects and arthropods to feed to their young. Still, when late summer rolls around, they're seen hanging around outdoor activities. Okay, the moment you've been waiting for. Quiz, question number two. What is the primary food source for wasps? A, candy bee, sodas, C, arthropods and insects, D, poolside barbecue wings. If you're thinking of selecting option C, yes, you're right. Arthropods and insects top the menu for wasps. Now, we can't talk about bees and wasps without acknowledging their environmental importance. They are unsung heroes, after all. When bees flit from one flower to another, they unintentionally act as Cupid, helping to scatter pollen and fertilize flowers. This helps to grow those scrumptious fruits, vegetables, and seeds we love munching on. Wasps, on the other hand, they're Mother Nature's personal insect pest control team. They help to keep the population of flies, spiders, and caterpillars in check. Final quiz question. What role do bees and wasps play in our environment? A. Pollinate our food crops. B. Distribute candy and sweets. C. Organize fancy insect galas. D. None of above. If you chose A, yes, you got it. Bees are vital pollinators and play a crucial role in maintaining our food crops. All right, bug buddies, let's wrap up. Today, we've had a bee-lightful adventure into the fascinating world of bees and wasps. From deciphering their unique appearances, to understanding their varied diets, and celebrating the vital role they play in our environment. Remember, team, a world without bees and wasps is a world without the delicious fruits and vegetables we enjoy. So, let's be the change makers. Our bug friends need us to be. Remember, Keep those knowledge buds blossoming and you'll always be buzzing with wisdom. Until our next episode, stay curious and keep learning. And that's a wrap. This buzzin' episode brought to you by Goalie, the best kid's tablet. My mind is blown. Where can I learn more about these videos? Oh yeah, getgoalie.com. There's no ads. There's no junk, just cool stuff for kids and a dedicated tablet. Check it out, getgoalie.com.